Morning everybody, so what are we doing? It's freezing cold day today. I've just once again checked the temperatures and the taters and we should be doing some drilling with a bit of luck. You'll be like, Farmer Jordan's in. Right, let's get into it. So, Farmer Jordan has a problem. What's the problem, Farmer Jordan? It's too hard. Why is it too hard? It's not it's too hard. hard. It's not too hard. If it was too hard, you wouldn't be trying to find chains in my yard. So, why is Farmer Jordan loaded up a load of chains? It's too hard. Because he's stuck! <laughs> the main man who gets nothing wrong has got a tractor stuck. Well, I get stuck now all the time. He does actually, he's Mr. Stuck. I've got some. <laughs> get through it, we're off. Right, that's going to get to sense there, so I won't tell you what he said then. Anyway, let's go and see Farmer Jordan and the stuck tractor. Right, I'll give you a lift to the teleport. I'll just give a lift to a teleport, so we might not see the stuck tractor, but you never know, we might call around and see it. Well, up, Pooch. So Farmer Jordan doesn't need my help. He said that he doesn't need us, so I've come back with the teleport and we're going to start drilling. I'll explain that in a second. But uh, for those who want to see Farmer Jordan stuck, here is... A photo that I managed to nab. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. I don't do anything wrong. That's hilarious. Anyway, so why have I got the body up on the tractor? Well, I just got it out of the shed uh, to get the drill sorted. We're going to go do some drilling. And it stopped. Now, it's because it's been sat a while and I think the diesel's gone all gammy. So I'm going to change the fuel filters and hopefully that cures the problem. It says there's no no fuel in the fuel pump on the screen, so I'm assuming that's what it is. So I'm just gonna whip a new filter in here, see if that makes a difference. Right, so I've just swipped this one round, or swapped that one. There's two on here, there's one in there, and there's another one here, filtration. I'm hoping this is the one that's blocked because um, I haven't got another one and I've got to go and nip to Ben Bird just to get one. So hopefully this will cure the problem, at least to get it over there would be nice. And I can pop a bit later and go and get one. So hopefully this is going to cure it. It's normally the front one. Normally. We'll have a look, see what happens. Fingers crossed. So the tractor now works. It was that filter. I've got another one on order, so they'll come in the next couple of days. Uh, what we're going to do now is I want to swap the seed around in the drill, because I want to drill Dawson, I want to drill Zaya, so I've got to drop the seed out. But first, I don't know if I remember just before we packed up for Christmas, uh, this happened. She's set. So I did wash the drill down, but I just want to double check to make sure that uh, I did get them all and I did poke them out just to make sure they still work. So I'm just going to go check them by eye to see if to see if they are actually all clean, the coulters, which are these bits here. So it's very important because the seed comes down these pipes and these are the bit that actually puts the seed inside the floor. And if they're blocked, the seed can't come out and therefore doesn't get drilled. So it's quite important that we do do that. So that's what we're going to do now for a second. Sorry, I've cleared the coulters out, as you can see. There was a one that was blocked that I missed. But, um, so what we're gonna do now is empty the seed out, because as I said, I don't want Dawson in it, I want Zaya. So I need to, there's still got a bit in it, so I'm gonna just empty the drill, swap the seed, and hopefully go drilling. But we need to, need to mend the drill, because that bit, the top keeps blowing off. We'll have a look at that. We'll get it empty and I'll, I'll show you. So how do we empty the drill? Quite simply, there's a bung at the bottom, under the bung. Then we're going to 
It's going to fall on this sheet here. So I can pick the sheet up with the teleporter and put it in the bag. What could possibly go wrong? now is put this into a bag to keep it safe. Now you're probably wondering why didn't I empty the drill before I packed it away for Christmas? It's because I honestly thought we was going to do some drilling over Christmas so I didn't want to go and empty the drill and then end up filling it back up again to go again. So I took my bets so I thought we was going to go a couple of days later but obviously we didn't and it got pushed back and I forgot. I've got other stuff to do so that is why. Anyways chuck this in and uh, we'll be away. Yeah, that could have gone better than it did. Some of the eagle eye viewers are probably wondering, where's the digger gone? Well, I'll show you. It's over there. Mr. Fu has got it. He's digging a few dikes out and a couple of trenches. He was keen to pick it up this morning. I'm pretty sure he's absolutely loving life. In fact, I might text him to see if he's loving life. I think he is. I just can see him smile there. So for Mr. Fu having fun on his digger, we're going to have, let's be honest, not that fun. Um, this is the bit I keep on about that's perished in the centre of there. So the air comes up from the fan of the bomb, up, and then the seed is then, um, so the seed's metered out, sorry, into the bottom, and it blows it up with the air, the fan that we just, that's at the bottom, and goes to here, the mushroom bit, that spreads it all out evenly through the coulters. But this bit keeps blowing off, which means seed, instead of going through the coal, through the pipes, goes up into the air, which is no good because I want it in the ground. So, without the bit turned up yet, I, I really want to go drilling, so I'm going to bodge it somehow. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> Put that on there. I've got found this is about the same size. So, let's just see what happens. I'll just take a load of tape with me and just hope for the best, basically. It's holding! I just need the bit that I just bodged on the drill. Uh, the real bit just uh, turned up. Literally turned up after I bodged it. I guess I take it with me just in case that don't work. I'll shove this in. Right, let's try and get some stuff in the ground finally. <laughs> That's the best this field's ever gone, and I'm not just saying that because I'm on camera, but it has. I mean, that bit of frost, there's still a bit of frost in, you can see the ground's still a bit. For most of it, the seed's covered, I think the seed's in, there's a bit there, a bit there. So it's in the ground, you can see that. There's one. Ready? So it's in. So that's the first one of the New Year campaign, which should have been done before Christmas. Now, mine has got some in. I'm quite pleased how that went actually. Really pleased. Pretty pleased with that. So that is it for the day. Actually, that's not the end. I've just come in house and um You just dropped seed all over the floor. This one. Everywhere. Now you stood there in your pants while I hoover it up. <laughs> Look at that action. Wow, Does that girl know how to work a hoover? Right, that is officially it. 
Say goodbye, Father Carolyn. Please like and subscribe and so forth.